Hi there everybody, I am here today with my ninth Cars and Trucks collection of video. Now, I know I've had a delay between videos, and I'm sorry about that because I've been rather busy with work and other stuff. So, without further ado, we'll tell you, I'll show you what's new in my collection. The newest ones up here is the camper van. I don't know if it's going to focus. There we go. I'm using my phone to record this instead of my iPad because, um, my iPad screen is cracked, and this is actually the first video I'm recording my phone. This is my first video I'm going to use, um, that I'm using my phone to record for, because, um, I never had my YouTube channel here, but now I do. Anyways, back onto the topic of vehicles. Um, this truck, which is also new. I wasn't too fond of it at first, but since it has a bed back there, I think I can overlook it. It's nice style, anyways. And... I don't know if I've mentioned this, I might have mentioned it, um, this bus right here, I probably already mentioned it in my video. Um, anyways, um, that's, that's a slightly newer addition in here, um, let's see, what is new? Oh yeah, the, um, classic Chevy, which is right here, the truck with a, the, um, four, the Chevy pickup truck, which is a classic one, it's got a surfboard on it or a board on it. Looks cool anyways. And that white police car on the back, that's new as well. And then we have slightly newer additions up here. Sorry if it's dark, my camera just won't focus. It is kind of dark on that, so it's a little dark back there. Um, The zoo vehicles, those are slightly newer additions to the collection. And um, let me think. I think that about does it up here. Just a little rearrangement, nothing special up here. And yeah, so, all right, we'll go up. Let me just close this. This will probably be my shortest Cars and Trucks collection update video. Or I don't know if that's gonna be true or not because they have been long or short, it just depends. Okay, I'm having trouble closing it. There we go, I got it closed. Um, so yeah, uh, that's about does it. Um, up here, there's been a little rearrangement that I forgot to point out. Um, I put the go-kart and the dump truck right on top of the bus just because I need some space for all my other vehicles. And then in here, we've had some slight arrangements on the top shelf. I had to put the bus up there. And I've had to put the uh, trailers for my trucks up there. And of course, my NASCARs are always up there. And then down here, we have some slight arrangements. Um, I have the classic Chevy right there. And then I have the police car right over there. So yeah. Just some small changes, and then up here it's been reorganized a little bit. So yeah, that about does it in there. Let's close it up. There we go, and we'll get up. <sighs> I do usually sit down when I go um, over here, and I'm usually standing when I go over there. And we'll go to the closet, because I haven't said anything since our closet. All right, this is the closet where the rest of my collection resides. Um, hang on, let me get the light on here. There we go. It takes it takes a few seconds to the light, John. But anyways, this is where the rest of my cars and trucks collection reside. For those that I, for the ones that I did not put on the shelf or in there, they reside in the closet, either in that bucket over there. Sorry if it's a little bright. My camera's not focused. There we go. My camera's focused on my phone. Um, some of them are residing over here. Sorry if it's dark. There we go. I mean, it takes a while for my camera to focus because I am using my phone instead of my iPad. Um, so yeah. Just wanted to point that out. That's where the rest reside, and we're about good in here. Let me close the closet door. So yeah, that about does it for my Cars and Trucks Collect video, my ninth update video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and bye.